Hey, um, it's Rose. I'm here to do a timeless reading. Yeah. So I already pulled um, some of your cards, but I am gonna be pulling some more just for clarification. Okay. Spirit, give me clear, honest communication and any other extra messages you want to um, tell me, please. Let me know. Give me clear, honest communication. Okay. So as I was pulling your card, I kept on um getting the the what was it? The tire moment. I kept on getting the tire moment cards. I don't know. Somebody's going through some heavy tire moment um, energy. And then as I was pulling your cards, I also, I'm, I'm like very tired. Somebody is like really, really tired or very drained. Um, yeah. I pick up on energy, so I know my energy is being messed with. Okay. So yeah. The spirit says believe in something different can happen. Okay. Cause you can't talk to losers about um winning. Someone wants to come in and cater to you. I see the um the high priestess card. And the Emperor card. Okay. Yeah. And your Emperor wants to give you a sweet life. Give you that sweet life. Okay. I'm getting fire um, energy and air energy. So fire and air. Am I holding it? Nope, I'm not holding it right. Wow. Fire and air energy come in. Okay. Your emperor wants to be loyal to you. But you have some fake friends um, around you. Okay. You tired of all the, the fuck to talk about. Okay. But your empress loves your body language. Um yeah. I see Larry Lake. Someone says wake up love. I see Larry Lake, London, Libby, Leonard, Lido, Laura. Okay. Something happening in October. Or October can be significant to someone. I see newborn. Somebody's probably getting pregnant. If that's the case, congratulations. I see N. Somebody's initials could be N. But your emperor is saying that you look perfect. Okay. And your emperor um, has a deep, sexy voice. And you have a soft, smooth voice. Okay. 
and your emperor saying that our souls connect. And they see you over there by your lip. They think you, they, it says, I see you like, but I see you lip biting over there, sexy ass. Giving you the wink, wink. <laughs> I'm done. Somebody's initials are, they want to come in fast. Look at our motorcycle. 1998. I see Annabelle, Anya, Asia. Okay. I see Cynthia, Cleo, Brian, Brandon, Brent, Brett. I see five. Um, I'm hearing angel number five, five, five. I see 10. I see November, so maybe November 10th. I see Johnny, Jordan, Jordell, Judith. I see three, 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 three. I see six. I see 18 through 21. I see the initials mm. I. I see the initials W, V. I'm hearing young love. Y'all gonna be having some young love. Something's happening in the month of May. I see the initials T. 2931. The song that's on is While We're Young, um, Janae Aiko. I want to go everywhere you go, everywhere you go. I don't know why my cards are all mixed up right now. The fuck is going on? <laughs> Bro, I'm hearing woo child, like what? What is going on? I'm hearing woo child. Like, okay. Woo child. Like, what the fuck? Okay. So I'm hearing they want to lay with you. I see two. Maybe angel number 222. Somebody's nickname is significant. I see Dominique. I see O. The initials O, Z, Q, and G. Okay. 
second. Ron, R O N, Ron, or one. I don't know what else, so. Okay. I'm hearing when you were, um, some, when you were a kid, um, you had to suffer a lot, okay? Child has to suffer a lot. But their violent delights have violent ends. So somebody's about to reap um, everything for coming for you. Okay. Yeah. Wow. 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 Yeah, the most high says don't give up. Because you're about to build your less legacy. And it says you would have done anything for your family and friends. It says the Most High is preparing their army to help you out. Okay. So you about to have, where is it? Let me see. Where is it? Where is it? You about to have double security. Okay. Because all that was just a lesson for a blessing. The 
if you haven't seen um birds or um ravens or any kind of like birds in the bird family um or feathers or whatever that's that's your you know that's um the birds are out and they they see they they see and everything like that and best believe they um they protecting you too okay so if you look around and you see them fighting or whatever they they fighting for you trust okay yeah It will burn like right as soon as I touch it. Okay. Apparently it doesn't want me. Okay. Most I said the time is yours. Step into your life purpose. Says family wants you to call them. Says history repeats itself. You were sent from heaven. You are earth angel. I'm hearing. It says, I have only one God, and that's the God in the sky. We don't have the same God. So they worship different gods. They worship the, the you know, everybody have different gods. Um, everybody worship, a lot of people worship different gods, okay? But you know what God you worship, and you know what God they worship. Like, they don't worship the same God you worship. Okay. Talking about being blessed and highly favored. I don't know what God they they blessed with. Mm. Most high said, "Go for it. Take that chance. Focus on your self worth. No time to stop. Close your eyes and listen." Yeah, just about really religion. Like, come on. And whatever they're doing is not working. Most I said, hell no. Nah. Okay. Someone is, is emotional. Talking about, please don't push me. I'm on the edge. But the most I says, no time to stop. Lead by example. Okay. Your emperor wants that late nights and early morning sex. You got somebody that crossed over and now they are trying to help and warn you so they know what kind of family and friends um you have you know they know what kind of people that you're dealing with and they tr they sending um protection to help you and everything like that um so yeah you got pocahontas um 
what's it called, bloodlines or whatever. Muhammad Ali. Like ancient bloodlines, pretty much. Like, I don't, I don't know. I know, but like, um, Yeah, but things are about to come in completion, okay? So, don't worry about it. So it's the wrong place at the wrong time. You can't save me from myself. saying I got me, myself, and I. Somebody got a dog. Yeah, your new love wants to, um, you know, give you new clothes, take you to the beach, go swimming with you. Someone just passed away, like I said. Somebody wants to take you to the museum. That's that emperor. You can be an artist. Are you loving on yourself right now? Okay. Your emperor fantasizing about you. Why? Because there's a warmth in your kiss. And your emperor gonna come in divine timing, okay? It says not planned, but created. So get ready for them. Something about your grandpa. I think your grandpa is the one that passed. Okay. And they're trying to protect you. They're trying to, you know, warn you from these people um, that's around your um, energy space. Yeah. Somebody either got stabbed or about to be... But you about to go from rags to riches, okay? I see unfinished business. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna come back to this. Yeah. But your emperor saying I'm ready to put it on you sexually. I'm trying to make love, not fuck. Yeah. Yeah, we're about to do it. Oof. Okay. Most high says things will change. Put cameras in your house and around your house. And don't lose faith. Somebody's birthday. Happy birthday. Okay. I see the Ten of Wands. 
you're overburdening you're overburdening your back hunch over in pain as you try to move you're carrying something so large you can't even see what's in front of you take a long hard look at how you're spending your time and energy you're not managing well you're not managing it well and it will burn you out now may be the time to find support so yeah as i was preparing this reading my back has been hurting okay like i thought it was just me this whole entire time like what the heck oh my gosh it hurts so bad too like Most I said, set realistic goals. Five of Cups. Something important has been lost. Maybe a relationship has ended or you've been laid off of work sadness is part of the process there is more love waiting for you when you're ready okay so trust and believe that there's more love waiting for you when you're ready because you know you're about to get this emperor okay but you have to like go you have to like set realistic goals manifest correctly you know do your shadow work and everything like that um before you can get this new love okay so, So it says unhealthy habits and desires can consume and control us um, regarding like money, sex, power, status, pleasure. You become obsessed with superficial and fleeting desires and it's let you down an unhealthy path. You may feel gu guilt. You may feel guilt and shame as you let these impulses control you and you might hurt yourself and those around you through your selfishness. Face the hard truth. Take the steps unnecessary take the steps necessary to break your change and seek help if you need to so don't focus on the realistic things focus on um life worth things if you're manifesting like don't be too into the real the um materialistic things you know set realistic goals like it says um so yeah Your emperor is working out at the gym, preparing for you. So if you need extra help, you can always talk to the most high about it, okay? And he will be able to help you. That's the truth. So you have an this extra energy coming in. So it's probably someone that she was dealing with in the past or someone that you just let go of. If you are wondering why it ended or um, if you need extra clarification on them or if you're about to leave them and you're trying to get that extra clarification on if you should leave them or not, we're about to dive into this, okay? Yeah. It says, you don't love me if you're putting your hands on me, period. They're having sleepless nights. Why? Because of this hard moment. And they're a snake. And they're in hermit mode. They're coming for your throne. Okay. 
Yeah. Talking about his unfinished business. I see porn industry. I see I got someone else pregnant. It says love's gonna get you killed. It says she emptied out his bank account. It says violence, so confirmation. Watches porn way too much. And then for the clarification on set um set realistic goals, it says stop focusing on the materialistic world. Most I says stop focusing on the materialistic world. Like I said, okay. Yeah. Your ex trying to put you in third party situations. Okay. I see Nicaragua, I see Puerto Rican, I see Georgia, I see Mexico, I see Iceland, I see Europe. One of these, um, one of those location will be the lo the vacation spot that you and your empress is going in, going to visit not all of them are going to be the vacation spot um a lot of them are just going to be from where you guys are from but one of them one of those location spots are going to be where you guys are visit are going to visit i see old and young okay um where is it So to clarify where the um to clarify the what the cameras it says side of the house windows doors I think that's it yeah your emperor wants to take you um out on dates dress suit somewhere fancy okay I see um for your for the the person that was trying to put you in third party situations I'm hearing um somebody's going to be going through judgment I guess I guess they're going to go go through judgment and I see health but bad health hospital electrical shock struck by lightning elevator so either the elevator is going to be stuck or somebody's going to be happening on the elevator at the hospital um either they're going to be struck by lightning um with an electrical shock or um their bad health or it might be all three shit for coming for you wearing a mask trying to pretend like they're all good and they love you and they care for you no the, no the fuck they do not they don't love nothing that's for them that's somebody else pregnant shit no oh and if all those don't happen to the person who's putting in that third party situation and then i'm hearing that um the people your family members who was fucking with you when you were um when you were a child okay one of them they're gonna be having um those situations as well happening to them so if it doesn't happen to the person who's putting in, in the third party situation then it's gonna be happening to your family 
Okay. Yeah, because the most high plan in it. I see Libra. I see Hermit again. I see balance. I see I'm about to block you. No answer. Okay. So if if they want to call you, whatever, do not answer them. Leave them in the cold. Don't even reply. Don't even respond. Yeah. Putting you in these third party situations. They don't lost their mind. <sighs> I'm seeing bus. I'm, I'm hearing somebody's going to get hit by a bus. Damn, what the I see school. I see the law has failed you. I see motorcycle. Something about a life insurance. Maybe some, maybe one of your family members stole your life insurance or have a life insurance policy put out on you. Yeah, the most high got one of them stuck in the matrix and now they in a whole entire maze. Can't even get out. Gonna be stuck for life, I'm hearing. For coming for you. I'm telling you, like. You got you you got a whole entire spirit team. Says death was planned. They try to plan your death. Now nah, they about to It says it'd be hard to understand because my jaw keep locked and somebody taking cocaine. Yeah, your upbringing was crazy. Like your upbringing was very tough, very crazy. Okay. Now they, um, the motorcycle impact, somebody gonna get, somebody finna die from Corona. Look at this. I'm telling you, it's cause, cause they was coming for you. Like they thought all they, um, stuff was going to be not seen or whatever like the most high see everything trying to poison you all that shit gonna get reversed and everything like that so yeah thank you being somebody being possessive you talking about i don't like games i don't like games either i don't like what they was doing to you either okay I see the colors yellow. I see the colors blue. Yeah, your abundance is coming in. And they about to get a whole tire moment. The tire moment came out again. Like your ex who was messing with you. Going through yeah, a lot. Someone is a female slash male. Karen slash Kyle. Tinker Tink. I see vampire trying to choose between you or them. Your um your fuckboy who was putting you into third party situations was trying to choose between you or them. You said you you said um you can have her. <laughs> The strangers become strangers again. Most high said. Yeah, when you was a child, you was around dangerous people. They they surround you around dangerous people. Okay. And now they kicked out of heaven. And you and you felt betrayed as a child. Because you were you just wanted love. You just wanted people that was gonna love you, people that was gonna take care of you, just like a regular child would want, right? They didn't do that. Your um emperor saying you remind me of someone I once knew, somebody that um is very um significant in their life, maybe a mother figure, you know, somebody or maybe a grandma. 
okay which is why they want to come in and give you that real love because their mother or grandma um um raised them to you know do it the traditional way you know what i mean like not rush into um things in that nature you know make sure they take their time with you and everything like that okay and to this fuck boy fuck girl whatever the most high says don't accept their offer no they said no okay don't bring them back into your life they worry they worrying because you about to cut all ties with them all right why because they always doing dark magic on you and now they about to get rejected because they're being stubborn okay and you're you're um your new little set i know you're the one i know you're the one for me okay and these people were playing mind games with you your your um emperor about to teach you true love real love we about to teach them the same i'm about to grow together you know because you're not trying to get by you're trying to get free okay you just wondering you wondering how you worry about me when you don't even got a soul they soulless okay somebody about to go through divorce somebody in a coat I see gun I see knife I see matrix that um that confirms the um the person that I said that was in the um matrix um and they they in a maze whatever they gonna be in a maze for life I'm, I'm hearing okay yeah gonna be in a whole entire fog coming for you somebody about to be under investigation okay yeah most high said hug a tree they want to hug you back so go outside and hug a tree they want you to hug you back and it might be it might sound weird or whatever but like honestly um this 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 materialistic stuff like that like that's that's it's just a whole entire um stimulation like before we ha even had this we were living in nature like caveman cave woman type shit like honestly i'm an earth person okay i'm weird in general i talk to nature i'm always in nature i love nature and Somebody told me to hug a tree once, and when I tell you I hugged a tree, and they really did hug me back, like, I, it was weird, but at the same time, like, I felt so much better. I felt really bad, um, really in a negative um, mentality before I hugged that tree. And the second I hugged that tree, I was smiling. I was so much happier, like... I'm telling you, trees, earth in general, they'll surprise you. Honestly, plant-based medicine can cure you faster than any of this drug dealing medicine. Doctors are the real, the biggest drug dealers of them all. Shh, I didn't, I didn't say what. Who said what? I, what we talking about? I don't know. I see Pisces. Plant-based medicine can literally heal you, like. Grounding your feet can heal you faster than any other remedy. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. I see FBI, I see CIA. Okay, somebody wanna copycat your work, your, um, your talents, your gifts somebody doing sex magic i'm guessing that's that fuck boy fuck girl doing sex magic i'm telling you the most high see everything they know what's going on behind door closed doors
I see Holly Weird. I see Little Ass Girls. I see Fight. Okay. And it says, like I said, the most high it says, you're going back to him, her, for what? Don't look stupid, please. You know how this ends. Okay, like I said. Come on. I'm, I'm just saying, like, it says distract them. Something about distract them. Damn, when is this going? Oh. Okay. I see gold digger. I see your boyfriend keep missing. I mean, she did spend a whole. I, she did spend. Um, what is it? What did it say? She spent all his his money, something like that. She she emptied out his bank account. There we go. Gold digger. So your your fuck boy fuck girl dealing with a gold digger. I see booth. Time in the booth, I guess. Um, yeah. Most high wants you to refresh. I see stolen identity. They were trying. They were trying to um, copy you, steal your image, steal your talents, and everything like that. Right. And now they're gonna steal your identity. Wow. But you saying I make my own money. I don't need your money. Exactly. Which is why you need to save and don't overspend nothing. Okay. And you're trying to hide all your pain because you can't trust these niggas. It says he gave me his number, but he know I ain't gonna call back. So he giving other people his numbers. Like that's that fuck boy, fuck girl energy, right? Talking about like, and the girl talking about whoever that he messing with, whoever he she messing with, it's, they said, um, if you fuck with me, I'll take your man. And they took him. Songs make you cry. You saying every time I see you, you bad mouthing my sisters. Why you gotta ride the pity bus? Yeah, I'm, I'm telling you, like he he don't wanna talk to these girls right. Messing with bag ladies. Like, and you just need time alone, okay, to meditate and reflect on everything that's happening, okay? Because they just want to put you in conflict. I see Capricorn. I see somebody jealous. Okay. But look, because they're coming for your throne. They got a shadow haunting them. Or that's what they feel like. They going crazy. Cops involved. Cold case. Selling pills. They having evil dark thoughts. I'm telling you, they going through it for coming for your throne. Why? Because you're the high priestess. Like, you don't play that shit. You know all. You see all. Like, come on. And you keep tracking of all what's going on too. Okay, I see sharpshooter. I see karmic. Like I said, that was your karmic um mate. You feel me? Trying to mess with your throat. But he messing with girls from the train tracks. Okay. But you got a check coming in. Something about your address is, is significant. Maybe it's because of the, I don't know. I see keys. You about to get some um, new keys. Oh, you about to change your address. <sighs> I just, I don't know why I didn't even connect at first. I don't know why I didn't connect at first. But you about to change your address. You about to level up, girl. Um, at appointment event I don't know what that means and you do this you do it very well so whatever you do you do it very well if they have to like steal your shit I mean like whatever you doing you doing very well okay like I said it's about to be a tire moment on you bitch ass for trying you most high not gonna let none of this stuff um go without notice okay 
so let's see what's about to happen. Let's see what's about to go on. Yeah, because they don't want to help you. They want to hurt you. Most I said, reconsider because you a psychic and you got spirit guides helping you. Like I said, you got a whole team helping you. Why? Because they stopping you. And you trust in your intuition. Mother figure involved. It says, I'm always in some new shit. That's why these hoes be looking exactly stalking your ass. Most of I said, change perspective. I see brother. I see aunt. I see surrender. So they, they surrendering now. Because they, they facing their judgment. All those tired moments, they facing their judgment. They reaping what's, what they giving to you. So everything they put out to you, it got reversed right back to them. And now they under, um, now they trying to surrender. Talking about, oh, I'm sorry. Oh, um, I didn't mean to do it. You didn't mean to do it, but you did it. You sorry, but you was hating on me. I, make make it make sense like I, these people are delusional i'm telling you most high said say your affirmations i am open to love i am in i am um damn my mind just went blank i am open to love i am about to see my um abundance i am about to get out of this negative energy I am deserving of um, positive change. I am deserving to um, receive my blessings. Okay? I am successful and abundant. I am grateful for everything that has been placed into my life. And I am ready for change. I am ready for this new love. I am ready to delete all these negative ass karmic people out of my life okay i am ready for new positive positive um i am ready for new positive doors to open up my mind is going blank right now Okay, so I see, wow, my mind is going blank right now. I see Knight of Cups. So the, the, the night is confident, charming, and wonderful to be around. They instantly draw you in, but be aware that they are not focused on you. They're focused entirely on their cup and, and are constantly looking for those brand new feelings of love and passion. This is a relationship that won't last for long as much as you would like it to. If the night is you, you'll be chasing feelings a little too much and need to take time to nurture your existing friendships and relationships. So you probably put a lot of energy into that fuck boy and fuck girl. And you need to take that back and place it within yourself, okay? Start loving back on yourself. Start treating yourself better. Because whatever you was doing, you were it was for practice. But now you're about to walk in some, into some real stuff, okay? And get that victory. Because you're about to ace up cups, that ass. You're about to lead them out in the cold. Okay? Ten of cups right it's a beautiful day a rainbow shines brightly in a clear blue sky and all is filled full of joy you've been through some trials and tribulations but your home life is perfectly at peace and in balance stop and smell the roses appreciate lo your loved ones around you and just enjoy these beautiful moments so go outside like i said plant your feet and focus entirely on you Take some time to breathe and reflect on what's going on. Do that shadow work and just embrace your new possi possi your new possibilities, your new change, you know. 
um reframe how you speak do not speak negative upon your life okay speak positive upon your life know that your new beginning is about to happen know that you're about to walk into this new opportunity with your emperor and your emperor is not going to treat you at all like these family and friends are going to treat you your emperor is not going to make you have not a single day of stress obviously in relationships people go through things but that's just that's just relationships right but your emperor is not gonna your emperor you you're not even gonna be stressing like like you stressing right now you're not even gonna be going through half of the shit that you're going through right now okay your emperor gonna make love to you every single day morning and night okay your emperor about to cook for you your emperor about to rub your feet your emperor about to put that bath water on you your emperor about to light them candles for you your emperor about to put some nice music in the background your emperor about to rub on you okay talking about how's your day beautiful like your emperor about to do everything okay for you you're not gonna be worrying about these people these fuck boy fuck girls whoever the fuck you're not about to go through none of that. Man, oh, no, no, no. <laughs> I'm dying. Uh, I cannot. You're not, you're not even about to go through half of this shit. I'm telling you. I see you happy, okay? I have I've just seen a whole glimpse of what you about to go through. You about to walk into this new address, this new foundation, this new location. You can be looking around like, bro, look at all this nice artifact type shit. That's what I'm saying. The most I don't even want you to be worried about materialistic things because whatever you manifesting is not even enough. It's gonna be so different compared to what you was thinking of. You was probably thinking of um, some nice shit, but the most high about to bless you with 10 times better, which is why you don't even need to be manifesting anything right now. You need to be setting realistic goals, okay? Setting um, outlooks on things. What do you really want, okay? You know you want to make love every single day. We got that. We already, we already have that on the list, okay? We already know that you're about to get, receive money. We already put that on the list. Okay? We already know that you're about to get new clothes, new shoes, new everything. We already put that on the list. Do you understand what I'm saying? That's already been on the list. We already had that. We already added that. Times 10. You about to have a whole closet. A whole walkthrough closet of just shoes. Come on now. We already put that on the list. You added extra shit. We already added that already. Is what we're trying to tell you. You don't even need to be focusing on that. You need to be focused on what am I going to do career-wise? What am I going to do? Um, how am I going to feel when I'm in this energy? When, I, when I'm in this new energy? Do I want to drag in all this extra burdens with me? Or do I want to come in as a new person? Am I going to shed half of my skin? Or am I going to shed all of my skin and start fresh and new? That's what you need to be worried about. You need to be worried about what your um your cook, your personal cook, about to make you for your um for your meals. That's what you need to be worried about. You need to be worried about how your kids gonna be um set. Are they gonna already have baby house already made for them? Are they about to go to college? What what do you want? What do you really want? We already have half of this shit already put on the list. We already have your list prepared. We already was preparing it as she was getting to this moment right now. We already know what's about to happen. We're just waiting on you to add the extra fine details not this extra materialistic stuff already we already know you about to get a new car whatever you whatever car you had in your mind we already know we about to get you way better than that you about to get a 2021 20, year car you you added 2019 2016 no 
Your car about to get you from A, B, C, and D, and it's about to be new. We already know that. What you need to do is set five things, five long-term goals, five short-term goals. Put that under your pillow. Sleep on top of that. Thank God for everything. Write stuff that you're grateful for. Okay? Sit outside in the morning, ground your feet. You need to just be working on just releasing all of this negative ass energy out of your energy field and expect me. Okay. Hang on. Okay? The hang one. It says true peace can only come I smell something burning nothing's burning okay cool true peace can only come from within oh that's what's burning damn they want you to write a forgiveness letter to yourself and um to your fucking to your to, to your family and also to this um this fuck boy fuck girl um but it's gonna be for yourself, okay? Um, and either you can write it just to forgive, you know. It's really a forgiveness letter, okay? And understand that you, it wasn't your fault. All the stuff that you been went through, it wasn't your fault. You, you was probably um saying oh i should have done this oh if i would have done this um this would never happen that's not the issue that's not the case here um the case is they were in the wrong you probably felt like you were in the wrong like they were in the wrong okay and you just need to write a forgiveness letter that you went through something it was a lesson for a blessing you literally went through something just to get out of something you literally went through something just to be taught something else okay so the burning smell is is because like maybe you can you can burn the um the letter i'm not pro i'm not persuading you to burn something and then it ends up catching on fire um, you can always rip the letter. I would say rip the letter because it's still a, an action, but burning the letter as well can also be an option. I don't want to say burn it and then something fucking happens. I don't want nothing to happen. I don't want anything furthermore to happen to you, okay? I want you to be in a way better predicament, okay? But I'm seeing I smell something burning. That could have been it. That's what I'm seeing. You can always rip. You can always write the letter. I'm gonna get something. You can always write it and then rip it. It's still a form of action, okay? And then throw it away. Is what we're is what I'm saying. You know but burning could be an, a, another possibility i wouldn't make that the first possibility i'm just saying because <laughs> i don't want y'all to come back to me and be like man like this whole this this bird and everything like that i, I don't want to be that I, i'm not forcing you to do anything and i'm not suggesting that i would rather you rip it up and throw it away yeah. Okay. The hang one. <clears throat> it says true peace can only come from within. Um, you might have just had some tough battles or obstacles to conquer. You might have to sacrifice something in order to reach this state of Zen, but don't worry. Embrace who you are and free yourself of other expectations and demands okay it may it may even feel like your self-care routine is a little strange to others but this process is crucial for you okay 
so this is it's the calm after the storm pretty much meditate slow down um nurture your body and soul relax take time to relax yeah that kind of stuff last thing let me make sure this don't burn since we're talking about burning last thing one of this So the ace of this, it says, trying to make sure, the ace of this, the root of the powers of earth, um, material gain, power, labor, wealth, contentment, and materialism. So yeah, like I said, you about to, you about to gain your wealth and materialism, okay? Um, so don't focus on that, okay? Because it's already coming. The most high says it. it's already coming. It's already gonna be done. We already know it's about to be done. Okay. Yeah. So that's your reading. I hope you guys have a wonderful day. Please don't forget to smile and you know. Give yourself that self-love. I'm hearing um, pour you a nice bath and just soak in it, like, you know? Damn, that almost burned. What the fuck? But listen, pour yourself a nice bath, a nice warm bath. Put some music on in the background. Light a candle and just, like, enjoy yourself. okay you got this i believe in you i know you're about to get this new opportunity leave that fuck boy fuck girl out of your energy space leave this these family members that don't like you okay once you take that leap of faith and leaving these these karmic people out of your life then trust and believe your abundance is coming in okay and it might take some time but guess what? It's all working in divine timing, okay? So you got this. I believe in you, okay? I know that you're about to go into something great. And you just really want to be loved. But your abundance is coming in. Why? Because you're blessed. So expect change. Expect new things coming into your life. Because you deserve it. The most high care about you way too much for you not to receive this and all that stuff that that they're trying to send and do to you trust me it's about to, it's getting reversed like you don't have to worry about that at all you feel as though you're alone and afraid but you're you're not alone okay the most high and your spirit guys and your spirit teams have been right beside you this whole entire time like i said like come on about to be going on helicopters like you about to be going on jets i'm hearing private helicopters come on and you might have a lot of opportunities coming your way all your exes trying to come back ignore dumb bitches don't even answer them but yeah you got this i love you don't forget to smile. Keep your energy in positivity. Keep your heart soft. You know, keep your strength up. You got this. Love you.